Last weekend, the Lost City Golf Course played the host to the final Gary Player Invitational of the year. Well, with the guests having raised over 4 million rand for the charities involved, it's now down to brass tacks and to see if any lessons have been learned from the first time out on the Lost City course. And being quite a competitive bunch to see how the lads and lasses are faring. Not too optimistic going in tomorrow, but uh, I uh, obviously played with some really uh, good and um, fit golfers today. But um, yeah, I was more a, uh, an extra, you know, a supporting role, but um, we managed to win the competition, which is not always a bad thing. I played well, which is a rare moment in golf, so uh, I wish I was playing with Gary. I'll have to step up tomorrow. Today was the first time I got to play the course. I think my team's ready. Hopefully we'll shoot some low scores. Um, the course is playing really well. I'm playing up as the same tees as the guys, so, um, you know, it's a little long, but I think I'll be able to hold my own, so uh, we'll see. With all the formalities and talking done, it was down to action. Team Johnson got proceedings started on the first hole under some difficult conditions, with the wind picking up and testing the player's skill. At the end of the day, it looked like Team Huisen was going to walk away with the title, as they were tied first with Team Fast. Today, the wind is back. How's it faring? Uh, a bit tougher than yesterday, you know, so obviously living, uh, trying to live up with the reputation of being a winner yesterday, but I uh, shouldn't carry it in today. You know, I actually went to go hit some balls on the range this morning, Ooh. but I don't think it actually should have done that. But, um, oh, you know, this, this ways and means of getting back into it. No, let up a very competitive field this year. It is, and I know Retief's behind us and Retief is cleaning up at the moment, but we've got a strong team. I think we'll come good by the end. But so far, so good coming through the first nine, looking incredibly good on the course. What's your experience so far? It's been good. I mean, we're just out here having a fun time. Um, it's been great to play with these guys. Hopefully we'll be able to, <laughs> especially this guy. <laughs> He's putting me in some dangerous situations today, being the driver and stuff, but it's been fun. Day two was another tight affair, with teams making their final push for the Boabab Trophy. Nicholas this fast team were four shots ahead of the chasing pack on the back nine. We're a couple off the pace, we're, we're feeling good. I've had uh, four Bloody Marys on the back side here. So with another one, we're going to go hunt those leaders. We're going to go hunt Nicholas Fast and, and his group. Well, I was so happy to see Brian Madfader not make it to the first tee this morning because <laughs> they're so good. We need a bit of a start, so he only joined on the second hole. But uh, he was great last night at singing and everybody was really moving and shaking. But this is so competitive. These guys, you know, they, they deal in big bucks in business, but they're out here, man, they're so serious and trying so hard. The spirit here, is, the competitive spirit is unbelievable, but we all have a good laugh as well. But in a remarkable turn of events, Team Huisen forced a playoff hole with Team Fast and would come out the eventual winners of a pulsating Gary Player Invitational. Well, what a way to set the tone for a brand new year ahead with Team Huisen. Congratulations, sir. Your team came through when you needed it most. Take us through the drama at the end of today. Yeah, we were three uh, three shots behind playing the last, and the guys played really well on the last hole, and then we tied for the lead. My partner, Mike, he made an awesome Next birdie the on the last hole with a shot for, for, to, to win the title. And I'm glad my birdie also helped towards it. So it was really nice to, uh, to win in a playoff. Uh, we looked a little bit down when we walked off 17 because we said, said to ourselves, you know, I think we're out now because we, we played the, the 17 one over and uh, so you never know till it's over. Did you expect a pro-am to be as competitive as this weekend has been? Yeah, no, it's great. I mean, it, it was tough conditions out there too, very windy and um, yeah, it's nice to, you know, for the guys, especially to get nervous, you know, we get nervous too. We want to try and help these guys to win. Uh, it was great fun. With over 4 million rand raised for charity and a new breed of golfing champions on earth, the Gary Player Invitational certainly did not disappoint.